What's up guys? It's Shining Eevee 123 back again with some more Pokemon X Palafru. Last time we explored part of Route 14. This time well and we caught a new team member. This time we're going to explore the rest of Route 14 and hopefully see what uh, is in store for us today. Uh, before we do anything though, I did go off screen and I did catch a new Scroopy. This one is serious nature because the last one we had was timid. And when Scroopy's attacks are all physical based, timid nature is not the best nature to have. So now I have a nature that doesn't mess with any of my stats or anything. So yeah, let's, let's go. And it's a female, but it doesn't really matter. So as soon as we take a step over here, come on, this way. And what's this? It's the haunted house. So this is the house. It is a scary house, isn't it? Well, I guess we should go inside. What? You're going inside? Are you all serious? Serena is off spending time with her Pokemon. So I guess... Oh, shit. <laughs> Wrong character. <laughs> this is why I don't do voices, guys. But here we are. Let's get started, then. It was a dark and stormy night many years ago. Lost. I arrived at this house and went inside. The lights would not turn on, so I fearfully looked around the house. Eventually, I made my way into the kitchen. There was no sign of anyone being here. I found the fridge, and when I opened it, a faint light leaked out. I could finally make out my surroundings. I saw the faint outline of a man huddling in the corner of the room. I tried to tell him that I was lost and was hoping he'd let me stay until morning, but when I approached him, the man suddenly screamed, STAY BACK! I apologized and continued to plead my case. Please, can't you help me? I'm not talking to you, he shouted. I'm talking to the man in surprise. I looked at the man in surprise. When I did this, the man asked me, Can't you see them behind you? A horde of faceless men! Now then, since I told a wonderful story that will always haunt you, would you be so kind as to tip me? If you don't, you might see something really scary. You're charging us? Even haunted houses aren't free, you know. We might as well give a tip. But I really, really doubt his story. Let's get out of here. Huh? Is it over already? I wasn't really listening. Was the story you just told really true? And we may never know. <sighs> I guess it really was a scary house in a way. Well, I know what... I know you wanted to go camping, and I, and that was kind of like camping, I guess. People usually tell scary stories by a campfire, right? I had enough of dark places and scary things. I had to have a rehearse my dance moves. I'll see you all later. What should I do next? I guess I'll go to Levere City. See you later, Biggie. Please compare Pokédex with me again soon. Bye bye. Then she's gonna stick around. Wow, there's graveyards here. In case this place is not creepy enough, there's graveyards. But yeah, I've also noticed that it's no longer raining here once you listen to his story. Oh dear. But yes, we can. Grab this item, it's the spell tag. Damn it. Try and get out of here. It's a 
Almost. Okay, and we are home free. Let's go. Le VSC. And we get TM41 Torment right as we enter the city. Alright, and we didn't really, you know, take any damage a lot in between episodes, so we can just explore the city right away instead of trying to find the Pokemon Center. Yeah, we might as well hear his story. Having a leaf stone makes you feel so relaxed. Don't you agree? That's not really a story, is it? My dad's older brother, that's my uncle, you know, lives in the Hoenn region. Foreshadowing at its finest. I think that's the first thing we've ever heard about um, the remakes for Ruby Sapphire. Oh yeah, the clothes. We haven't bought any clothes in a while. I'm happy with what I'm wearing, to be honest. Maybe I'll get some new jeans, actually. Let's get some, yeah, let's get some new jeans. Because, why not? Beige? Yeah, might as well, forget it. Clothes are like the most expensive thing in this whole freaking region. I'm going to change back to the hat I was wearing, go to my jeans, Let's put on my beige ones, see what that looks like. Yeah, that's not too bad. I think I preferred the brown ones, but we'll leave it with that for now. And see how it goes. Yeah, actually it doesn't look too bad. Right, let's go. I'm not gonna buy any clothes for again for a while because we just spent ten grand on a freaking pair of jeans. Ten grand on a pair of jeans. Here's the Pokemon Center. I might as well go in there now while I have a chance to. And here's Mr. Bonding. Oh yeah, it's bonding time. Encounter power level one. And let's rock and roll. Do you do anything? Nope. Oh, but there's two clerks. One of them's gotta have TMs, right? Not this one. Well, this one. No, he has protein. He has um, drugs and stuff. Drugs! Let's see... Super potion. We kind of need hyper potions now, actually. I've already got 20, so that should be enough. I'll get five more super potions, though, just in case. And now I'm all out of money. <laughs> Great. All because... I wanted a new pair of jeans. We literally just... Sorry to bother you, but I like tiny things. Whoa! Your interests are of no interest to me. If you like... Man, if you only like 12 inch stuff, then... That's totally on you. But yeah, this right here is the gym, but, you know, I'm not ready to take on another gym just yet, because we only took on a gym, like, what, two episodes ago now? Yeah, so, things are moving swiftly now, I mean, 
there was a huge gap in between the first two gyms. But now it's just like anytime we fight a gym, we're already at another gym. Crap. I didn't notice my camera. Sorry about that. But yeah, let's uh, let's continue on for uh, the city, exploring it. And this girl will give you the Gengar right, which is great because you can actually catch Haunter on Route 14, which is the route before this place, and it evolves through trade, so you can pretty much get a Mega Revolution right off the bat with that one. And you don't really have to wait, you just have to make sure you've got someone you can trade with. So you're going to have to have another DS, because I think the GTS was shut down. <laughs> For this game at least. Screw you, man. Here we go. No, I don't want to hear stories about any gym badges. Let's continue. Alright, this is the Pokeball Factory. I don't think we need to be here just yet. I know that for a fact. That we don't have to be here just yet. So I think all that's left to do is take on the gym. There is a cafe here, which is really good. And this girl likes big things. So we've got a guy who likes small things and a girl who likes big things. This town is sick. Anyway. I don't remember what... Yeah, I remember what gym this is. Okay. Good job we caught Skaroopy because... Hey. Skaroopy will actually come in very handy in this gym. So yes, let's go. And I complete I don't even remember the gym puzzle for this gym. I'm just gonna run around like a lunatic, hoping that these rooms lead somewhere. Let's try this one, see where this goes. Alright, and we have a trainer battle. Fantastic. Let's go. Right now. Come on. She's cute. Aromatist. Alright, Toasty. Um, you're 10 levels lower. I want to see if you can actually do anything. You're out of speed, which is great. Wow. <gasps> the poison comes through! I'm sorry, but that's just too good. But, you know, stab, super effective with poison thing, with the added boost from the poison barb that I gave it, still doesn't KO. So, I'm going to have to literally keep switching it in and out. And I'm going to have to share the experience with Beacon, because Beacon's actually trailing behind the rest of the team a little bit. Yikes, that did a lot of damage. Alright. And Beacon, it's morphing time! Oh yeah! And there we go, we have Ampharos. Mold Breaker. Alright, I can only hope that Aromatissi hits itself here. Please? Nope. But that's alright. Used flail, so that's not too bad. And I'm going to not use one of them, but use a 
Or I'm gonna use a full restore. I don't know where I got it, and I'm gonna use it. Just because I have it. And the rheumatism is about to go down. I have an electro ball! So that was a lot easier than I was making it out to be. And there's going to be a level up for Beacon to level 34. And Toasty's just going to get loads of experience. Alright. Moving on. There's no pools here. Step in this one. See where this leads us. And this leads us to another room with a trainer in it. Don't we just look like a bunch of dolls in a dollhouse? Yeah, you do. Doll. She's cute too. Blossom. You're kidding me. Clef key? What's Clef key weak to? Because it's not weak to poison since it's part steel type. It's not weak to fire because fairy resists fire. Ground, I guess? But I haven't got a ground type move. Damn. Alright, Beacon. Back in you come. In prison. Torment. Now I can't use the same move twice in a row. God damn it. I don't think the Thunder Wave is really going to matter too much, especially if Klefki has the Prankster ability. But oh well. Oh wait, yeah, Mold Breaker. Crap, I forgot about that. How? I don't know, but Klefki's going to die. <laughs> he dropped his keys! Come on, let Blossom know she dropped her keys. And Cle I almost said Clefairy, I meant Curlia. Jeez. But yeah, Curlia is now fairy type, but it's still psychic, so Toasty's in a bit of bother here. But we'll persevere through it. I'm just gonna switch train between Toasty and Beacon, because they're my two lowest level Pokemon. Beacon should be a little higher, I think. Just because, you know, we've used it so much. Although we haven't been using it recently, which is probably why it's been falling behind in levels. Please don't have Synchronize. You have Synchronize. Oh, but it doesn't affect me. Magical Leaf, I resist that because I'm part Dragon. And Electro Ball. And down goes the Curlia. Bye! And Toasty Goo to level 31. And Beacon is so close to level 35. It's strange, because I have to get Toasty all the way to level 40 before she evolves. Which is going to be very difficult to do, with her being the level she's at, but... Oh well, I'm going to do my best. Even if I have to train her off screen to catch up to the rest of the team. And Mold Breaker. You know what, yeah, that's Thunder Wave. Because this is my little combo for now. Thunder Wave mixed with Electro Ball. Might not be the best, but hey, I guess the damn job done. Haha, <laughs> you're fully paralyzed. At least it would have got the job done. But oh yeah, Ampharos is slower. 
because it loses speed when it mega evolves. I keep forgetting. Why did that do so much? Anyway, Hyper Potion. And you can't move because you're fully powered. And Electro Ball. Rage! Does next to nothing. Okay. And down goes the Grand Ball. Beacon level 35. And wants to learn Power Gem. I guess I can get rid of Thundershock. I don't really use Thundershock that much. So, yeah, Power Gem would be great. And there we go. You're no doll. You're a true Pokemon trainer. And we get two grand for winning. Oh, yeah. Anyway, back to Pokemon. Go to Beacon. Swap Electro Ball for Power Gem. I'll need to go back and heal eventually, but right now I think we're doing fine. Now where do I go? Not this room. Not this room either. I wish I knew where I was going. I battled you, didn't I? Yeah, I did. I've just come from this room. Ah, new location. This is the thing. We're going to be wandering around this gym for a while because I sometimes I don't know where I'm going. But yes. Catherine, Catherine, why was I about to say Catherine? I don't know. But let's get on with this. She has Slurpuff on her team. Her only Pokemon, so it's gonna be level 40. But it's fine because Beacon's pretty much caught up to the rest of the team now. Oh, voice crack, I love it. But yeah, I'm gonna have to train Skaroopy off screen. I don't want to do that, I don't like doing that, but I'm gonna have to if I wanted to stand any chance in this gym. Let's go. Mega Evolve, you guys are going to be so sick of seeing Mega Ampharos, but how can you not love that hair? Look at that hair, man! Look at that hair! Oh, crap! We got played! Because now that we're part dragon, we are weak to fairy. Alright. Electro Ball. And down goes Slurpuff. Alright. And now let's see if we can work our way to the fourth and final trainer of this gym. Oh! Never mind, we're at the gym later. I'm not gonna battle her right now because I don't feel confident with my team, so I'm actually gonna go heal and we'll see where things go. Oh my god, I can't even leave this room like that till I beat her. Are you kidding me? Alright, let's try and find our way out as quick as possible then. Because I wanna go heal. And from here, we'll go here. And from here, we'll go here. And 
And there we go. We can now leave the gym and go heal. Alright, so that's going to be it for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, make sure you like this video if you're enjoying the series. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications so you immediately know when I upload next. Follow me on all my social media sites. Uh, or, and by that I mean Facebook. Just Facebook. And it's Shining EV123. Over and out.